Alright, so we're going to be reacting to a better version of the segment between Cody Rose and Sting. So it's just that uncut, we hear from Sting for the first time ever in AEW. So it was great that he debuted last Wednesday and it was still the most talked about. And shout out to y'all for showing your boy love and support. Got over 3,000 views and I couldn't thank you guys enough for showing your love and support for my content and that really all that matters. So without further ado, let's see what he, well, let's just see what this version is about. I just love Cody Rose's new entrance in Old Eli Wrestling. I just love his interest. TNT champion Darby Allen did as well. You have to imagine he's keeping an eye out for Team Taz. And like all of us, has a very keen interest in what Cody has to say, which we will hear right after this short break. So don't go anywhere. We are back on Dynamite in the ring with the American Nightmare Cody Rhodes, the head coach. Hope y'all can hear. Uh, turn it up some more. Uh-oh, there you go. Just like The Undertaker, staying in AEW's entrance. So good. So good. I love it. Woo! My boy, Sting. I forgot they were in WCW at one point. Sorry. I just had to get a little closer to make sure this was real. Oh, it's real, all right. Now, I see you've got an agenda. And I know you do. So, for now, I'm just going to see my way out of here. Yeah, good idea. <laughs> well, who am I to stand here? Here you go, buddy. I, wait, Tony, are you kidding me? Come on, bring it in. Give me a hug. <laughs> I mean, how many years has it been, Tony? So many. That's right. Is that some... Tony... You know something, I gotta give you some kudos for helping me out in my career. I mean, I can't tell you how many times I've actually thought about you saying, It's Sting! <laughs> Wrestling fans approach me and say, We loved it when Shivani said that, so. Oh, yeah. Would you mind just entertaining everybody and giving me one of those right now? Oh, yeah. I wanna hear it. Just one, it's Sting, right? 
Come on, give it to us. <laughs> Keep in mind, I wasn't really a WCW fan, but I have heard some good things about Sting and Dan and Tony. to share a ring with you for a very, very long time. Cody, I, I'm not here for you. Mm. <laughs> at least not right now. I mean, there's something that makes me feel at home in this place. I mean, there's something really familiar about it. I mean, something really, really familiar about this place. I'm guessing he's talking about that title. I mean, as I look at ringside here, I see that the uh, animals are the same, but different in a lot of ways. The bottom line is, I'm in the jungle. This is the jungle, and the stinger has come full circle. The Stinger is in the jungle and on TNT once again. I just love their stage, man. All you like wrestling has had the best stage. This is definitely WCW 2.0 in a lot of good ways. Like I said, sir, welcome back. Cody, I know that you know every single thing that goes on around this place, but you know me too, and you know what I say. The only thing for sure about Sting is nothing's for sure. Except this. I am signed officially with AEW. Yeah, we know about that. You already knew about that. To the AEW wrestling fans and in this promotion for a long time. We've known about that. I plan on spending a lot of time right here. Yeah. But the way I choose to play, Cody, is, is, is my business. See you around, kid. Once again, man, Sting is just. <sighs> I can tell you a few reasons why he's teasing a match with somebody, but I can show you that he's not going to be taking any bumps. But I will say this he's going to be around this company doing something wherever it is it's going to be a whole lot better 10 times better than what they're doing in the wwe because in the wwe they completely wasted him debuted as a survivor series in 2014 then he got buried in the wwe at wrestlemania and by seth rollins thanks to that he retired and now that he's with all eli wrestling i feel like he has a great home with the company that can Treat him with the amount of respect that he deserves. As far as the, his entrance and the character goes, I think he has a great place for AEW, especially on TNT. What y'all think in the comment section below? Let me know, and I'll see you later.